Ukraine could get its big guns ready to fight the Russian forces after a long period of ammunition starvation, although it may be a while as countries are redrawing their plans to supply much-needed arms to Kyiv. One of them is France that has announced it will give hundreds of its old armored vehicles and surface-to-air missiles to Ukraine. The French defense minister has said his country is working on a new ammunition aid package this will include old but still functional French equipment. The package is expected to reach Kyiv by the beginning of next year. The Defence Minister, Saud France, is also releasing a new batch of Aster 30 surface to air missiles to Kyiv. The Aster 30 can intercept warplanes, drones, and cruise missiles and has a range of 120 kilometers. Additionally, France will deliver remotely operated ammunition to Ukraine as early as this summer. Earlier this month, the Biden administration also announced a new aid package for Ukraine worth over $300 million. This was after Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky warned they might have to retreat from more territories if the U.S. aid does not arrive soon. However, President Joe Biden admitted that the package is not enough and more needs to be done. An aid bill passed in the Senate seeks over $60 billion for Ukraine. Washington is the largest provider of military assistance to Ukraine. As of now, total security assistance provided by the U.S. since the start of the war is around $44 billion. However, the war in Ukraine has evolved and so has their demand for weapons. Although one emerging bright spot is a small but fast-growing defense industry in Ukraine. The effort began over the last year as the U.S. and Europe strained to deliver weapons and other aid to Ukraine. The Ukrainian government budgeted nearly $1.4 billion in 2024 to develop weapons at home. This is 20 times more than before Russia's full-scale invasion. However, the defense sector is largely constrained due to lack of money. For all the latest news, download the Wii on app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.